Hey guys, today we talk about a double pickup that I got in the New Balance 999 Hyannis, aka Kennedy's. Tune in. Hey guys, welcome to Casa Station where we talk sneakers. My name is Zoe, and if you're here for the first time, make sure you hit that subscribe button and even that notification bell so you don't miss any dope sneaker content. The sneakers you've all been waiting for, the New Balance 999 in the red and also blue colorway, also known as the Kennedy and also currently called the Hyannis. Man, oh man, these sneakers are, you already know about to say, dope sauce. Glad to have finally caught these sneakers. Been trying to get these for a very long time. Tried to get them at Complex Con. Of course. Struck out. Swung out of this. This time around, Concepts decided to redistribute these sneakers to the public and finally I was able to cop and I'm very glad and I definitely had to go with both colorways because I love, absolutely love these New Balance 999 Kennedys. But anyways guys, enough yapping, let's get straight into the sneaker review. So looking at the inside of the sneaker, you'll notice a whole bunch of nautical demarcations in red, white, and blue. And also you'll notice that it's a little bit gray in there as well. You'll also notice a Concepts flag in red in the right sneaker. And on the left sneaker, you'll notice that the Concepts flag is in blue. In addition to that, looking on the outside of the sneaker, you'll see that it's made up of mesh and also nice suede. And also at the heel of the sneaker, you'll have a tarp-like material in red. And on the blue sneaker, obviously it is in blue. Overall, I love the materials on the sneaker. I always love sneakers that have good quality and New Balance never lacks in that. When you look at the tongue, you'll notice also that there's a nice plush suede as well and also a nylon tarp feel tongue on the sneaker as well. Also, you'll see that there's more nautical insignia on the top of the tongue of the sneaker. And apparently this is supposed to mean something or mean concepts. And for those who sail, let me know down in the comments if you guys understand what this sneaker lingo means. I don't personally understand what it means. All I care about is if it's a dope sneaker and this is definitely a dope sneaker. In addition to the dope uppers that come on this New Balance 999, you'll also notice that it comes with a whole outlook of shoelaces all flat shoelaces with a variation of gray coloring white coloring red and white coloring blue and white coloring and also at the tips of the sneaker you have either a blue or also a red concepts logo aglet that you'll notice as well oh yeah and I almost forgot the red pair of the New Balance 999 has a grommet that is blue at the top and the one that is blue the 999 that is, has a red grommet at the top. And I think those are really cool touches to the sneakers in general because it really helps the sneakers stand out in my personal opinion when looking at it from afar. The midsole of these New Balance 999 are made up of a absorb material. And in addition to that, they have variations of light gray and dark gray and white when it comes to the midsole. The outsole of the sneaker is a light gray and a dark gray on both sneakers. So overall, dope to me. These sneakers are very subtle but very dope to me and I love that when it comes to this particular New Balance 999. So sizing wise when it comes to these particular New Balance 999s I would say go a half size down. I got each of these bad boys in a size 12 and they fit me perfectly. Also compared to old versions of the Kennedys you'll notice that these are a little bit more tapered at the tip of the toe box and I really appreciate that because I love when my sneakers are tapered and and a little bit less bulky. Although these sneakers could be qualified as bulky sneakers, I really do appreciate the tapering of the toe box when it comes to this particular New Balance 999. So apparently these New Balances were inspired by Kennedy, President Kennedy, in regards to his boating experience and excursions around New England region. So I think that was a dope, you know, story behind these sneakers. And it's really nice to always have a story behind a sneaker that is genuine. I appreciate the art of the sneakers more when that story is present. Hey guys, so Casa question of the day. What did you guys think about these particular New Balance 999s? Did you end up copying on the restock? And also, what did you think about people saying that these were going to be Complex Con exclusives but ended up being restocked 
at concepts let me know down in the comment section below and let's talk about it people hey guys so my sneaker talk is up for today please remember to like comment share and subscribe if your boy treats you well and you enjoyed the video and also maybe hit that notification for the one time guys i appreciate all of you guys for watching my video oh yeah i almost forgot deuces